Were there people offended that they were not invited to your wedding? For me personally, I, I lived in Vegas for a little bit. Right. Um, I, so I really, and I, and I just, I was not a fan of Vegas. You know, it just wasn't, um, it wasn't for me, man. You know, I moved there right after, uh, or right before the housing collapse, or, or in the midst of it. So it was, it just, you know, it just wasn't, it didn't work out for me. So, but I, but I'm an affable guy. People like me. I made a lot of friends there, but I really didn't invite anybody from that part of my life. And there's one dude particular, uh, Mike Dixon, that he moved back to Boston and I had spoken to him prior and I had told him, yeah, bro, you're definitely coming to my wedding. And then when I went and did the invitations or when we sent out the list, I just, I had no one to associate with him with. You know what I mean? Like he was a random because he moved back to Boston. So when I'm, I'm picturing this person, that person, I, he just never entered my head and I never invited him. Because at he that was, point you were putting like the wedding, you were putting people in chairs. Like we had to do a yeah, seating chart. Yeah. And it just made sense. This person made, you know, everybody made sense. I, he was a random that wouldn't, that he just wasn't in my mind. So I never... If I remembered him, he was a million percent invited, but I didn't remember him. And there then were, he was, yeah, there was he wasn't people. offended, but he was just, you know, you could tell because he was, they were looking to take off time for work. And I remember him reaching out uh, and it was like, you know, a few weeks after the wedding. You I know? think that's what it is. If there's someone in your life that you think being invited might be an obligation to them, then you might just think maybe, maybe they don't have to you know, come because they don't care. Yeah, if, they, if they're apathetic and they don't want to go, like I said, if they get that invitation in the mail and the first thing they're thinking is, oh, fuck, I got to go to this. Because that's me. That's me. Especially out here, you know, because most of the weddings that we're going to be invited to are her friends. And people So, like, that wedding comes flaky. like, oh, fuck, I got to go to this thing. If you're going to have... If you're going to have... A, the, 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 if, if both people... the. You know, being invited, I'm gonna be like, oh fuck, we have this wedding. Because then you, have then to, I don't want you at the wedding. Because the thing is, like, when you're invited to a wedding, you have a suit. You have to make sure it's pressed. Yeah. You have to make sure you have clean socks that match. All that. Trust me, the day of the wedding comes, all of a sudden you're like, where is it? Oh, it's far. It's you. Oh my god, 45 minutes away. Yeah. And then you have to figure out who your date's gonna be. And there, even for a random guest to show up to your wedding, it's. It's something for them. So they might not even show up because they don't have their suit cleaned or they don't know who the date's going to be or, or they don't care. someone's going to be at the wedding that they don't like too much. Right. You know, that happens a lot. You know, right. Or they used to date. Or they're hungover. Or they, they used to date. Now that person's married and they're fucking happy and they don't want to see that person married and happy. You know what some Shaw's tea is? Whoa. I didn't go to Tom. Uh. <laughs> I like how you said what like that. Anyway. I didn't go to Mike's wedding because he didn't invite you. Well, no, he didn't invite you with a plus one. Right. That's why you were pissed. Right. At the time, he didn't know me. At the time, we he thought had just, you were going to be temporary. We had just kind of got shacked up, but you were mad like that. You couldn't even bring your mother. Like you know, you mm -hmm. know, they'd like I, I should have gotten a plus one to your wedding. And a hundred percent. Yeah. So you, and it go. was in downtown LA. Yeah. You wouldn't go. So for me to go down, I got to tell you, he was, I was right. No, you were a person then that you aren't now. You would go now. I'm not saying uh, see, like you wouldn't be like, that's not reasons not to go to a wedding just for someone you love and care about. You were using that as like a spoiled brat. Like he didn't give me a plan. I'm not, I'm not even going because you were going off that whole week, and then that day you just move. You know, you're getting, you're moving around slower than usual. The day kind of got away from you, as it does to happen. And then it was, well, you know what? He didn't even give me a price one. I'm not going. I don't think today you would do that. I don't think like if he invited you to. Fair enough. Listen. What's her face? Jessica. Pa Paulina. No, I'm just kidding. What's that? Paulina. If he invited you to Paulina's wedding, uh, you and same situation, so you, you would go. You would go. By myself? Yeah. Can I just say that the reason I didn't go was because for a woman to go by herself to a hotel in downtown LA with an Uber alone, that to me is, take Mike out of the situation, that's rude. A woman gets very emotional on a wedding, even if it's not her own wedding. It's it's not. It's like being a guest and going solo is, it's a crisis. It's not fun. 
It's like going through. It's like putting someone's head through a ringer. Okay. Every step of the way, we want to walk in holding somebody's hand. Okay. If you don't have someone to hold your hand, or at least your gay best friend, that means that you have to do all that. You have to stand there by valet, have all these other happy couples. Honey, you your your shawl fell off of your left shoulder. Let me help you with it. No, you're not going to be standing there ass by yourself and then. I think a lot of women go to weddings by themselves with other girlfriends. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. It's not a party. It's not a. There's a lot. I know a lot of women that have been invited to weddings that they're not in a relationship. They might meet a guy at the wedding. Yeah, but then you have to feel. They're looking to go single. You don't want to go Sally solo to no wedding. I don't know, bro. I dis. I disagree. I think that you are not speaking for the vast majority that you think you are. And I know. Yeah, Mostly princess. women out there listening, uh, I'd like to hear what you have to say. So in the comments this week on social, if you could, let us know what your opinion is about going to a wedding solo as a woman. I love that. I love that. And I do want to know because I want to know if you're alone, how many times have you already gone to a wedding alone, which is the reason why you don't want to go to the next wedding alone, because you don't want to be, it's those moments of loneliness when a man is helping his wife with her shawl over her shoulder that she or or you walk out of a bathroom and you're by yourself but the other girl has a man that's sitting patiently and waiting for her those are the reasons why every time that you have a wedding invite you're always supposed to give somebody a plus one as an etiquette thing so i'd rather and you know what else you can also say that you can also say that um Hey, listen, I'm only going to invite you, but do you want a plus one? Like we reached out to people specifically to say, yeah, I did that. do you want a plus one? Yeah. Because if you want a plus one, we gave them to those people. Yeah. And if they were like, oh no, hell no, I'm coming with my girls. Like you invited Tommy, you invited like most of your friends were already friends with each other. So it was like a whole thing, but don't do that to a girl. And it's like, yeah, this, the T is since nobody knows that I didn't go to Mike's wedding because i was pissed and i was i felt i deserved it and um <laughs> Did you fucking land the plane bro and he ended up not staying married so it's fine yeah 